Hi friends. Bright and early this morning. It is 8.45. Ashley is headed to the bus right now. Do you want this jacket? Oh, you got that one on. Look how cute she is. She can't bend. She got all quirked. <laughs> <laughs> Laying in her little squishmallow what, cocoon. Is that what we're calling it? Okay, I'm good. I'm working on the computer already this morning. I am dressed ready to go because I have a dentist appointment. And at 7.15 they texted me and they were like, can you come a half hour later? And I'm like, I can. Snooze. <laughs> so that was quite nice. But I have about an hour's worth of work to do here at home. And then I have to go to this dentist appointment. We'll chat here in a second. We'll take Ashley to the bus. Okay, I gotta, we usually don't leave before the bus leaves, but I gotta get back and get some work done. Gotta go to the bank, gotta go to the dentist appointment, gotta go to get blood work at the hospital, get Chelsea to a scan, and then we have this party tonight with Ashley. I thought I would just bring you along today and kind of show you the chaos of mom life, I guess. So this was on the doorstep. We went out to the bus, and I'm excited to share this video with you tomorrow. It's kind of killing me that I don't have time today to work on this at all. But I will have this whole area changing because of this package. <laughs> um, this has got some office supplies in it here. And then there's two things here that are going to kind of change my desk. So stay tuned for that. But I literally don't have time to even like open this right now. It's killing me. My world is spinning round, round, around. Oh, I want you now. A lot longer than I thought it was going to take. Just the cleaning, but um, the tech was like very talkative. And she's like, Can we keep working? <laughs> like, work while you talk. Um, so, and then we had to uh, schedule. Oh man, I just got done paying on all of my dental work and Jason's dental work from last year. And, uh, <laughs> Oh, I have three more crowns and then like some work done on another tooth and it's like he's like are you ready to like start again and I was like all right and he's like okay can you come back in next week and I was like oh like you mean like right now like <laughs> so unfortunately I couldn't schedule wise but I don't know I hate teeth literally dread coming to the dentist but this is a new dentist our regular dentist just retired. Sorry for the lisp. Whenever I get my teeth cleaned, cleans out, I have like gaps right where the gum is. And uh, I'd love to get like gum filler. And I think that's a thing, because I, I have little gaps in my teeth that couldn't be fixed from just like bra braces or whatever. They're as straight as they can be. Anyway, but. Um, what was I gonna say? Now I'm in a race. Since that took longer than I anticipated it taking, um, I can't go and do some blood work at the hospital. You can go anytime you want. Um, but I had to go get Abby from school. Her back pain is just too bad and I, I feel bad. And she knows what classes are okay to miss and what she can make up from home. It's easier for her to just be at home doing her homework, catching up from bed. She doesn't do this regularly by any means, but on the days where I know she's in extreme pain, I let her come home and do it from home. So I'm gonna go get her and then maybe I will, we'll see how much time I've got. I've gotta get home to take, no, I, I don't even think I have time after. I have to take Chelsea to a scan, um, one of those ultrasound scans. She's now going to earn some money and I had to pick her up from school. I hope she remembers that. I really hope she remembers to get on, to not get on the bus. It's not usual for my kids to have to do parent pickup. I really hope she remembers. <laughs> so frustrated right now. I have just been in the car nonstop today. Hang on. And, uh, and actually I am going to cheat the regular lanes on this highway on ramp for the absolute worst. So I'm going to cheat and get into the carpool lane. 
I don't like kill my tires. Um, anyway, I've been in the car nonstop. I'm starving, which is where I'm headed now because I can't even go home. I, I'm so frustrated. Not because I've been in the car all day. I've been, I knew this was gonna be a car day. I knew it was gonna be like an on the go day. I didn't plan for anything at home. I didn't even put in laundry. I knew I was gonna be on the road. But I just went up to the hospital, to the lab, to do my blood work for my thyroid check appointment next week. And I thought I was to totally be on top of it and getting it done. And then they were like, well, there's no order for you to get blood work done. And I'm like, so I called the office and I don't have time now to wait. Um, I have to go get Chelsea, like I said. Um, and I called the office and I'm like, yeah, you have an appointment next week. And I was like, to check my thyroid, right? And she's like, yeah, that's what it says. And I was like, in order to check my thyroid, I need to do blood work, right? And she's like, yeah. And I was like, there's no order at the lab. I just left. She's like, oh, that sucks. She's like, can you wait a half hour? And I was like, why? And she's like, because we used to have a, a rule of that the lab work would expire after a year like when you have an appointment it's an automatic like kind of renewal for the lab work and they just shortened it to six months <laughs> so mine expired she's like I can probably get the doctor to renew it in the next half hour if you can wait and I was like I don't have time to wait she's like can you come in in the morning you do need to get it done before your appointment next week and I was like I know that's why I came today that was wasted, but I'm glad I didn't waste Abby's time. I was gonna have her stay with me because I didn't want to, literally I've been crossing town back and forth, back and forth, but she just wanted to go home. So I'm going to grab something to eat. I'm trying to decide. I really could go for a Cafe Rio, but I don't think I even have time to eat that. And I hate eating Cafe Rio, Rio in the car and I literally don't even have time to go home. So struggles. I should have made myself a sandwich, but I literally didn't even have time to do that this morning. It is 4.45, and this is the first time I have stepped into my house since 9 a.m. this morning. <sighs> so tiring. There's a little pook right there, right? We've been to McDonald's twice today. Chelsea got her dinner after we got done with her scan. And that is Abby's. Can you take that up to Abby? I never came home and gave her a sweet roll when I got McDonald's the first time. So let's take this up to her and see how she's doing. And I have an hour and 15 minutes until I have to leave again. I'm so tired. Go, go, go. Poor thing. <laughs> I really hope I caught that on camera. I won't repeat it in case I didn't catch it on camera. Abby is asleep. She does not feel well. I am taking her to the pediatrician in, I don't even know what day, <laughs> maybe Thursday. So many appointments this week. <sighs> Ashley, I got the extra picture of Camry at Walgreens. No, I have lilies. Yeah, I have lilies. So, I don't think we need to do anything else but show up early to help set up, correct? But we should put the cupcakes. Should we go put these in the car, Ash? Who's coming? Like, can you yeah. No, it's just mom and daughter. No, mm -hmm. but like for other activities. Um, Abby probably will not be coming. Chelsea is, because she has. No, 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 careful. Go put it in the car. Just put it on the seat. Please run real quick. I have to. I can't. Yeah, you open can. the door. Then set it down on the stair and then come and then open the gir the here. I'll come help you. Abby probably will not go to her activity because they're playing human hungry hippos. <laughs> and her back could not handle that tonight. So let me take these out of the car and we'll be back. Okay. Um there's literally nothing going on here. Abby needs to unload and dishes need to get loaded. But I'm gonna make dad do that when he gets home. I'm gonna rest, like not rest. There's no way I can lay down and take a nap. But I'm gonna chill for a minute. <laughs> Is your back still hurting you? Yes. <laughs> you couldn't stand up this morning. <laughs> you gotta move your pillows out of the way so you can lay better on your bed. I, 
kind of cracked my back, but. Yeah, maybe take a bath tonight after. No, we don't have time tonight. Yeah. Have daddy massage it tonight, okay? Pop it. Okay, I'm gonna turn you guys off for a bit. I'm gonna relax and get more water in me. I've had way too much caffeine. So, I've had, this is my second water, but I need to have more than that today. Okay, we're heading to Ashley's party. Can you hold that? Do you have the cupcakes on the, okay, you got it? Okay, you guys, this is like car vlog at its worst. <laughs> now we have these two kids with me and we're heading down to the church. Chelsea just has a regular activity. What was it they were doing tonight, Chelsea? I told you about it. Now I can't remember. Abby's not going. I knew her back wouldn't, she just barely woke up. She's like, no, I'm not going to play human hungry hippos. Um, but we've got to go and help set up for this tea party for Ashley's class. And I've got flowers there, like you saw. My friend has done all the rest of it. So we'll show you the decor when we get there and get it all set up. If she's okay with that, and she should be, but um, her and her mom have done um, weddings, like flower floral arrangements for weddings professionally. So I'm, I'm not worried about <laughs> what she's put together. Um, it should be really, really cute. Not that we had a huge budget. Like we maybe had $20 budget. <laughs> it's not that big. So I'm just, it'll be cute because it's just a little teeny tiny setup. Um, we've got the cupcakes. I couldn't find my glassware, but they have it covered with like paper glasses in it. So we should be fine. Let's go to the church and I'll show you how we set this up. And then when we get home, I'm going to bed. So I may not be ending the video with you <laughs> after this event. So just know that I appreciate you guys watching even on a crazy day like today. And just know that like, once again, I keep it real. I If I waited until we had super fantastic themed, you know, day where we had a complete intention of what we could film you wouldn't get a vlog from us <laughs> because I you know our life is pretty normal tomorrow though I am doing a little office overhaul not overhaul my countertop is gonna have a little bit of an overhaul and I'm excited you saw that package that I got today so I'm very excited to kind of wake up in the morning and get that all cleaned off and redone so stick around for that that'll be fun um, and then like literally, I don't know, I have appointments all week long this week and next week, so we'll see what we do after that. Say something like you love me and make my day like you always do, like you always do.